144 students from 11 secondary schools on Ireland entered the first round of competition, hoping to secure the top spot of recognition for their approach to addressing issues of climate change. Combined, their efforts resulted in 30 entries at the first stage of competition, with students from the St. Mary's College, Sufra Comprehensive, Leon Hess Comprehensive, Entrepot and Beanfield Comprehensive Secondary Schools entering the final round of judging. Minister with Responsibility for Commerce, Manufacturing, Business Development and Consumer Affairs, Honorable Emma Hippolyte, congratulated participants, highlighting the need for innovation in mitigating the effects of climate change. In recent years, the need to effectively and comprehensively address the issue of climate change has become increasingly urgent. We are witnessing the devastating impacts of rising temperatures, extreme water events, and environmental degradation on communities around the world. More now than ever, we need innovative solutions and bold action. Chief Executive Officer of Sponsor, STUF United Fund, John Lynn, expressed congratulations to participating students. The competition emerged through collaboration between the Ministries of Education, Sustainable Development, Innovation, Science, Technology and Vocational Training, Commerce, Manufacturing, Business Development Cooperatives and Consumer Affairs, as well as the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan. Artificial intelligence represents the future of global trends, and it is exhilarating to see Sanusian secondary school students engage deeply with AI through this competition. Their involvement clearly indicates a move towards a brighter future in AI technologies. To ensure winning submissions were all selected by fair process, projects were presented to judges anonymously, with final rankings disclosed at the award ceremony. Of the nine final teams, six received honorable mentions. The five male finalists all created interactive audiovisual presentations highlighting the impact of climate change. Students from the Sufra Comprehensive Secondary School captured third place. Submissions from the St. Mary's College secured the second and first place ranking. Expressing pride in the achievements attained, Education Minister Honorable Sean Edward noted the value of such pursuits. The remarkable creativity and ingenuity displayed in their projects are a testament to their passion for making a positive and lasting impact on the world around them. Your hard work, perseverance, and innovative thinking have set you apart as true leaders in the use of technology to address environmental challenges. Minister Edward says innovation continues to be encouraged through the ongoing ICT in Education program through which the provision of smart classrooms, some 5,000 internet bundles, and devices to assist in educational pursuits have been secured. From the Communications Unit of the Department of Education, Innovation, and Vocational Training, I am Kiba Talium reporting.